Das nächste Match ist ein Mystery Mayhem Umschlag Match. Angesetzt auf One Fall. zum Ring. Mit einem Gewicht von 90 Kilogramm aus Istanbul in der Türkei für Berlin. The Sultan of Wrestling, Cem Kaplan. Uh, he is from Istanbul. Well, this is going to be a collision of two young bulls with a mystery mayhem envelope for the winner. Sultan of Wrestling, Cham Kaplan! What a powerhouse Cham Kaplan is, former Berlin champion. Und sein Gegner. Auf dem Weg zum Ring. Mit einem Gewicht von 90 Kilogramm aus Erfurt in Deutschland, Mr. No Bullshit, Marius al -Ani. Yeah, speaking of powerhouses, Marius al -Ani. What a debut he has had here in the past Mr. few months. Mr. No Bullshit, Marius al -Ani. Look at the stare down between these two. Alani made his debut in GWF in the latter part of 2019. Kaplan's been around for a while longer than that. He was part of Group Anarchy until midway through 2019. Finally saw the light in that regard and has been breaking out on his own. And a big, big win in a lumberjack match against his former mentor Ali Aslan on night one of Legacy and of course a big tag team victory alongside Evil Jared, the Bloodhound Gang against Group Anarchy the following night. So Kaplan's star very much on the rise. Marius Alani deeply impressive as well. Only one of these two men can be the next to leave tonight with a mystery mayhem envelope guaranteeing them a mystery title opportunity this May, later on this year. And both of these guys are just at that point in their careers here. And you get the impression that they would absolutely love to go for one of the top, top titles. Whether it was the world title or Kaplan, another shot at the Berlin title, I'm sure would be appealing as well, as it would be for Alani. Two colliding with each other. Both of them look like they are carved out of granite. Neither man budging an inch on these shoulder blocks. It's going to be a physical, intense showdown between these two. Big scoop slam from Alani. Another one from Kaplan in return. Force with which these two are slamming each other is really something to behold as Kaplan goes to the ropes. An attempt at a kick from Alani. Alani transitions into a sweeper hold. But all of his body weight on the back of Kaplan. See Kaplan backing into that corner. It's going to force the break. Alani won't give a clean break, goes straight back in to the sleeper hold. Maybe this time, again, doesn't give him long to recover as Alani scoops him up and slams Kaplan down. Picking up the pace now, there's a leapfrog from Kaplan. Kaplan with great agility to complement that strength as an arm drag from the Sultan of Wrestling. Big body slam as well. 
And Catwan starting to gain the upper hand. Getting up ahead of steam here, and now he's going to try and ensure that Alani cannot do the same thing by wearing him down. Once again, they are in the corner, and Alani will. I thought he was going to have to go for the break. Instead, he transitioned out of the corner, clotheslines Kaplan to the canvas. So the cover didn't hook the leg, only gets a one count. Now Arnie, to his credit, didn't give Kaplan any time to recover. He's gone straight back to that right arm now, just trying to control Kaplan. Kaplan having to battle to get back to a standing position, which he's done, but a snap suplex from Alani, who floats over. Marius Alani on a one count and straight back into wearing down Kaplan. Big, big prize up for grabs for the winner here. One of those mystery mayhem envelopes. Kaplan showing some resilience. He obviously wants it just as much as Alani. I thought it was going to be a Russian leg sweep, but he rolled through to Alani. And now stretching out Jim Kaplan. Variation of the abdominal stretch, you can see it. The entire right side of Kaplan. A real taut applied there, and now Alani with a snap there. Drop kick into the back of the head, he'll go for the cover, gets all of his body weight down on those arms. Kaplan having to expend a lot of energy to kick out twice. Been a more methodical performance than we've seen from Alani, I think, here. Not relying entirely on his power game because he knows that Kaplan can match him there. Tries to scoop him up, in fact, but Kaplan got out of the way. And Kaplan with shoulder block. This time Alani does go down from a shoulder block. He'll go down from a second one as well. Will it be a trio of shoulder blocks? The Jeff Kaplan, yes, it will. Close line attempt from Alani, Kaplan catches him. Sit out spine buster and kick out on two from Alani. Big crowd support here for Jem Kaplan, as you can hear. Things really have turned around for Jem Kaplan in terms of crowd support since he left Group Banerjee last year. Best career decision he ever made, I think. If you look at the success he's starting to have now, now that he is flying solo, Kaplan is trying for the super plays. It looks like a Kimura attempt from Al Arni in response, and now Al Arni finds himself on the top rope. Kaplan in a dangerous place in the middle of the ring. Kaplan saw it coming though, ran towards the turnbuckle to dodge Alani. I thought Alani was going to try and roll him up instead of knee into the temple. Kaplan could be unconscious. Alani, all of that body weight down on the shoulders, and Kaplan kicked out. But again, more and more energy having to be expended by Jen Kaplan. And you cannot help but be impressed by the strategy of Alani and how it is playing out here. Oh, Alani looking for that ankle lock, that trademark ankle lock of his, trying to twist to that ankle, forcey submission from Kaplan. Alani in the end goes face first into that middle turnbuckle. Kaplan needs to get some blood flowing back into that leg that the ankle lock was applied onto. Alani, what a look at that. Great agility, but great balance from Kaplan to stay on his feet from that Hurricane Rana. Kaplan going to turn Alani upside down. Kaplan to the ropes and a drop kick into the abdomen of Alani from Jem Kaplan. The cover now. Got that right leg hooked and Alani kicked out, but not particularly convincingly. 
Kaplan is onto something here. He is definitely wearing down Alani, who, as you can see, is blinking and shaking the cobwebs off. Kaplan needs to be careful. He doesn't want to give Alani too much time to recover. Kaplan will look. Maybe looking for the Sultan smash. That's exactly what he's trying for, but Alani had it scout him. Kaplan lands behind. It's a belly to belly suplex from Jem Kaplan. Holds on for a second one. Great strength. Great endurance as well from Jem Kaplan. Kaplan to the ropes. And for the discus in the end, he ran into a drop kick from Alani. The cover from Marius Alani and Mr. No BS. It was a half a second away from winning a mystery mayhem envelope. Alani looking, I think, for the power bomb. Gets it with authority as well. Folds up Kaplan for a two count. Shoulder goes up. Kaplan could have to submit his an armbar attempt by Marius Alani. You can see that Kaplan has got that butcher's hook grip on his arm to stop it being hyperextended. Got the right foot onto the bottom rope and forced the break. <laughs> Vicious from Alani. Kaplan moved out of the way and Kaplan will roll him up. Jem Kaplan with the roll up for a two count. Kaplan, well he's caught him this time. Kaplan, no he hasn't. Alani escaping the salt and smash for a second time and now into the ankle lock. Ankle lock from Alani. This time because of that body position, Kaplan's going to find it much harder to edge towards the ropes. Alani switching to Increase the pressure on that left ankle of Jem Kaplan. Kaplan, can he reach that bottom rope? Or is Kaplan going to have to tap out here? Kaplan made it. Kaplan made it, but he's been dragged back. Now Lani goes for the elbow. No one there. The full Nelson. A seated full Nelson from Jem Kaplan. And in the powerful arms of Jem Kaplan, that could do... Real damage, that could knock you out. Marius Alani will do well not to pass out. And this full Nelson, oh, counter, but it, a counter of the counter by Kaplan, got the shoulders of Alani down from the deadlift position. What a suplex from Jeb Kaplan, the cover and a kick out. I don't think Kaplan had enough left after all of that power that that took to lift Alani. It was no real emphasis behind that cover. Alani just about was able to escape, but Kaplan is first to his feet again. Jim Kaplan in control. Point of the elbow into the side of the head of Alani. Three times now. Alani went for the overhead throw, that big suplex. Kaplan though, throws him to the ropes, put the head down too early, paid for it, Alani will look for the power bomb a second time, gets it a second time, will this time be enough? No it won't, because Kaplan gets out again. This has been a war, a real war here for this mystery mayhem envelope. Between Alani and Kaplan. Chantons of what of Marius Alani breaking out as well. Fans here respecting the efforts of both of these men. Alani just clubbing repeatedly at Kaplan in the corner. Kaplan had the energy completely wiped out of him. By that flurry of offense from Alani. Kaplan. A look of defiance in the 
face of Catwan, but how long can he continue to defy strikes like that? Catwan down to his knees, a third power bomb perhaps from Aani. The counter from Catwan. Backdrop from Catwan. This time he gets it with the discus elbow. And Catwan scoops him up. This time, Sultan smash from Jem Kaplan. Kaplan with the cover, and Jem Kaplan wins a mystery mayhem envelope. And he's the winner from Istanbul in the Turkey for Berlin, the Sultan of Wrestling, Jem Kaplan. What a battle between Jem Kaplan and Marius Alani, but it is Kaplan who is going to get that title opportunity with a hard-fought victory here at Strike First, Strike Hard. Big, big win. Big, big win for Jean Kaplan. Make no mistake about it. Kaplan, I'm not sure it's sunk in yet, but it will now as Olaf Hands those envelope to the referee. Und auch das war ein Mystery Mayhem Umschlag Match. Das bedeutet, herzlichen Glückwunsch, Cem Kaplan ist beim Mystery Mayhem auf jeden Fall dabei und er hat die Chance auf einen Champion Titel. Und jetzt ist Glück gefragt. Umschlag mit der roten Farbe. Wir werden sehen beim Mystery Mayhem Loserweight Championship Match, Tag Team Championship, Berlin Championship oder World Championship. Herzlichen Glückwunsch, du bist dabei. Der Sieger in diesem Kampf, The Sultan of Wrestling, Jim Kaplan! How consequential will that decision be? Has Jim Kaplan picked the right envelope? Opportunity knocks for the Sultan of Wrestling as he heads towards Mystery Mayhem with an envelope in hand.